It has been 582 days since anyone has seen Madalena Kojukari, and tonight we are learning Cornelius police are officially naming Madalena's mother as their suspect in her disappearance. Thanks for joining us on Queen City News at 10. I'm Brian Blakely. Good evening to you. I'm Alicia Barnes. Well, this is the first time police have called Diana Kojukari a suspect. It's Queen City News reporter Daniel Pierce is learning tonight police are keeping tight lipped on what it means for the investigation. Cornelius police making this announcement via Twitter in both English and Romanian that Diana Kojakari is a suspect. However, they confirm with me that she is not wanted. She is not facing new charges, but she is a suspect. This sign's been at the front doors of the Cornelius Police Department for more than a year. It displays Madalena Kojakari's photo to everyone who passes. Inside sits a box of birthday cards addressed to her untouched. Police still believe Madalena's mother, Diana, could help them answer questions they've been asking for 19 months. Is Madalena safe right now? Do you know where she is? I hope so. This is the moment Diana Kojakari was released from the Mecklenburg County Jail after she pleaded guilty for failing to report her daughter missing. A jury found husband Christopher Palmeter guilty for the same crime. They did not let anyone know Madalena was missing until December 15th, 2022, 24 days after she was last seen. Any conversations about where she is, anything like that? Um, yeah, I've asked, I've asked where she is. Okay. Um, she said she didn't know. Queen City News obtained interviews Cornelius police had with Palmer and Diana Kojakari about what they knew about where Madalena was. I did ask her where she is. Mm -hmm. I, I, I never got a straight, a straight answer. Evidence we obtained on Diana did have video of an interview, but not the audio. Officials tell us this is because since the case involved Palmer, the video they received had Kojakari's audio muted. Prior to all of this, there were also conversations Diana recorded with her husband where she sounded paranoid. I do not know where it's coming from, but my intuition, woman intuition, okay, says Something wrong can happen. In Palmer's court hearing, he mentioned Diana asked for help to protect Madalena from potential harm. She believes Russian entities were following her. We are working to learn if Diana Kojakari is still in the U.S. or if she has been deported. I've continually asked Cornelius police why they decided to announce via Twitter that Diana is a suspect. I'm still waiting for a response. In Cornelius, Daniel Pierce, Queen City News. All right, and just to bring you up to speed on this case, Madalena Kojakari was 11 years old when she disappeared in November of 2022. She was last seen getting off of her school bus. That's what you're looking at here in Cornelius. Her parents did not report her missing until mid-December, and police arrested Diana Kojakari and Christopher Palmer around the same time for failing to report their daughter's disappearance, there's been no progress in learning Madalena's whereabouts in the last 19 months. That's despite the involvement of state and federal investigators.